The overall goal of this adeno-associated virus vector gene transfer is to genetically manipulate the rat's brain and spinal cord on an expansive, wide-scale basis. This method can help answer key questions in the gene transfer field. It is a very efficient way to introduce genes in vivo, and therefore a very powerful, very versatile technique. This procedure is both rapid and highly reproducible. We have used this wide-scale gene transfer approach to express an amyotrophic lateral sclerosis-related protein throughout the spinal cord of rats in several publications. My colleague Robert Dayton will be demonstrating the procedure. Michael Grames will be assisting Robert. Begin by preparing the workstation. First, clean the surface with 70% ethanol. Then place a heating pad in the work area and set it to warm to 37 degrees Celsius. Place a bench pad on top of the heating pad. Check that there is adequate oxygen and isoflurane for the procedure. Clean the induction chamber and anesthesia mask with 70% ethanol. And place the anesthesia mask on the bench pad. Make sure that the following are on hand. One paraffin film square of about 5 by 5 centimeters per animal, one alcohol preparation pad, and two or three gauze pads per animal, pipette tips, and a micro pipette. Then, thaw the vector at room temperature and label one sterile microcentrifuge tube for each animal. Pipette the required volume of AAV into the...